Well, that's a great effort from the England bowlers. A lead of 21 runs there. They made 272 and bowled out Pakistan for 251. And once again, Pakistan, when they look at that scorecard, will just think of what might have been. A top score of 58 for Mansoor. There were good partnerships all the way down the line, but they never, ever managed to go on with it. And the England bowling, well, there's uh, one or two surprise packets there. Ian Botham, two for 86. That's not a surprise packet, but uh, Ian Gregg is four for 53 and opening the bowling for England as well. Bob Willis on at first change, taking two. And I thought the best bowler of the day was uh, Eddie Hemmings, two for 56, 24 overs and five maidens. Fine effort from him. So a lead of 21 for England. A good effort, some marvellous play, some good batting, good bowling up to that point. And here's the start of the England innings with that lead of 21. Derek Randall is taking strike to Imran Khan. His partner is Chris Tavery. It's a good delivery to start with from Imran Khan. The new ball will have a little bit of extra bounce in it. Tavare did the right thing and was through quickly there to get Randall away from the strike. Oh dear, he was safe. And, uh, oh, good heavens. First of all, they had Mosin Khan coming in at 100 miles an hour from uh, the left. Here it goes, and Derek Randall making good ground very quickly, and, and he's well in. Motion scrams it in, and then that's followed up by... <laughs> A little bit of luck there for Derek Randall. Dug that in, he had a flick at it, and uh, got the ball between the first and second slip. Sikanda to Randall. Yeah, that's a great shot. Yeah, just as well he's got a man out there. So the 50 comes up for England, an opening stand of 50. And this is the second innings. That 51 for no wicket is a fine effort from Randall and Tavre. Definitely a makeshift opening pair. And once again, Randall showed he was a little nervy in the number one spot, but he's still there and he's made 30 runs. And Chris Tavare has made 15, 51 for no wicket, and 21 was the first innings lead. So they're on by 72 now, and that is a very handy lead because uh, I think the ball will keep on playing at varying heights off this pitch. And uh, the side batting last, and that'll be Pakistan, may have a problem or two today. Nawaz, here's the Pakistan captain now coming into ball the last ball of the first over of the day, he's bowling to Derek Randall and no runs have been added. Beautiful stroke for four. Shorter than Imran would have wanted it and it's just about Randall's pet shot. Uh, it's a good boat, he could wrong him. Not unfair to say that um, Randall didn't pick it. Yes, it's the googly. It turns a lot. Randall on the back foot, and it, well, all but bowls him. And <laughs> he'll be happy to jig away and pick up uh, a few runs. Side, Abdul Kadir. Bonus of uh, a couple there. Well, it's a good contest, isn't it? Uh, they know that Randall doesn't read the leg spin of the googly, can't pick it, so Randall's trying to knock his way out of that cage of close fielders. Will he pick the right strokes? That's the uh, whole problem at the moment. Now, there's a man being put back at deep backward square. He's waiting for the 
sweep picks up the top edge. Well, I said pick the right shots. That really was not a great shot, foot nowhere near it, but uh, it worked. They have a pitch ball, the half volley, he's placed it away all right this time, throw it to cover for four, and the four brings it Derek Randall past the 50 mark. 52 on the board now, received just uh, 71 balls, and including seven boundaries. He's just had a few problems with the leg spin of uh, Kadir this morning. And faces him again. Mowed that round through mid wicket. Not the most elegant shot in the business, but uh, a very effective one this time. Oh, well bowled. Didn't pick that. Just three more runs added to take the total up uh, at lunchtime to 143 for five, but a series of disasters there. And Tahir, the forgotten man of yesterday and of the first innings, has chipped in with four wickets. A tremendous performance and one that he's unlikely to forget. The not-out batsman there, Jeff Miller, who was lucky to survive just before lunch, he's on two. And Randall, playing an absolute blinder there, is 85 not out. And I should think feeling very, very happy with himself. An adventure shot, uh, happily for Randall and England, he middled it, but uh, he whacked that away around the mid-wicket from somewhere around about off stump. Well, it's him or me, Derek, Randall says, and not in the coaching book, against the spin. Oh, it's very close. Just fractionally away from that off stump. Well, this really is the leg spinner's art. That boat from the end of the line. It's again, very smartly played. Got to uh, right in position, turning it away. That's four very valuable runs for uh, Derek Randall. That's a good time to hit a boundary. It goes from 92 to 96. Spence of the deep square, he's coming in to save the single. Just trying to put this little bit of pressure on a batsman on 99. Oh, what a lovely ball, a long hop is bowled. Oh, my word, it couldn't have been better for, for Derek Randall. Halfway down, at the first bad ball, he's bowled in a spell. It's hammered away for four runs, taking Derek Randall through to a fine 100. 103 out of a total of 175 for seven. Played on. Randall is gone, and he won't be too pleased about that because uh, he'll realise later that Eddie Hemmings, in fact, is playing pretty well at the moment, and that that is uh, almost a sacrifice wicket. And no shot at all, really. Drags it back off the inside edge into the middle and late. 